Hey everybody, this is part two of Behemoth Breeze. I'm really excited. Um, Sky left a comment in the last one saying that this is one of his favorite episodes to write, which is very interesting to me because it's such an early episode. I mean, maybe that's just because there's so many like uh, some so many things happening at once. You know, so many so many plot lines inching around in this episode. You've got the bit with um, Crusade and Mine. You've got um, Red Guy wrecking shit in the fucking um, in in the, sh in the ship. And you've got Combo somewhere doing something, probably. So there's so much going on at the moment. So I understand it's probably there probably is a lot of fun to write that. Um, I'm really excited. I'm by the way, I'm using this playlist. Um, it's not the official playlist, but it seems to have all of the um, all of the main episodes and as as well as the uh, as well as the, the special episode. Um, but but it doesn't have any side verse content. And I know that's in a different universe, so it's not probably not necessarily something I need to watch like intersperse with the main series. But um, if anybody like has any like suggestions of things that I should be putting in aside from main episodes and watching those in conjunction with the main episodes, then let me know. Because I'm I'm not using the official playlist because as, of, as far as I remember, the official playlist is a little messy. You know, it's got a couple of videos that were added accidentally and it's still got all the um, non HD episodes like mixed in with the mixed in with the HD ones. So it's a little it's a little jumbled in there. But anyways, uh, this is part two of Behemoth Breeze. I'm really excited. We get to see more of Crusade, um, my baby girl, and we get to see more of Red Guy, my other baby girl. I'm very excited. And also we get to see mine, who's my only baby girl who's actually a girl. So let's go. Oh boy, oh boy. Action HD? Yeah, okay. Oh boy, oh boy. Woohoo! Oh, I forgot she's British. Oh, she's so British. I said, I, I, I said something in a previous reaction to the like. I, I think it was like, I, I think Sky spelled something with like an O U, where where most Americans would spell with an uh, with with something else. Like probably just not know. And I, and I and I comment and I commented that that Sky might be British, but I think that maybe the fact that mine is so like overwhelmingly like stereotypically British might work against that theory. <laughs> <laughs> arms. I guess they're arms. Is it me or does that gun feel kind of a scribble Nazi? It's got like a. It, it's got the. It's got like the the, the weird like a um, misshapen form and the black outlines. Then again, mo most of these Kirby sprites have black outlines too. Aren't we being rather bossy? Jesus! You know, bullets can ricochet off of things. That could have still gotten someone hurt. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> She's stupid. Uh, my hearing's actually great, so... So I, if I didn't hear it, it didn't happen. So fuck you. <laughs> Gross. Weird. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. It's so weird that this isn't in widescreen. Oof. The, cla the, the classic Kirby Rapid Punch spray. What? <laughs> we did the Stardew Valley duplication glitch. Mm. Go on, explain your powers to us. What are you fucking talking about? Yay! Thank you. Thank you for the exposition. I forgot we didn't learn what X traits are yet. They they, they were like they, they were alluding to them very very gently before. Me 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 when they have quirks from Boku no Hero Academia in the show. 
Oh boy. It's sad they didn't just call them abilities. Co <laughs> the, 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 the decanonization of copy abilities is so strong. Poor thing. All those, all those copy essences are just lying in a big pile underground, gathering dust. Well, you can just grow your hair back, yeah? It'd be sad if she couldn't. If, if she copies too many things, she'll end up like a regular Kirby. She'll still she'll look she'll still look pretty good. I love I love I love black and pink together. It's one of my favorite combinations. I wish I I wish I was a baby mouse reader when I was a kid. I would have loved it. Oh my god. Jesus. <laughs> She's fucked in the head. That's a nice that's a, that's a nice like holding sprite. I wonder if um I, 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 I've started taking up the um the, the arduous task of like trying to sprite a character. And that, nothing nothing crazy so far. I don't I don't I don't want to I don't want to give my guy hair. But my, my the important part is like they're gonna they're gonna have like the magic hat, yeah. So before I even bother making the character themselves, I'm just adding the magic hat to a bunch of Kirby sprites because I imagine if anybody else ever wants to make a, a magic hat character, those sprites might be useful. So I wonder if all of these sprites have have Kirby variants. It would be, it'd be interesting to see like a full a full sheet of of, um, of Spirit XL customs. There's probably a ton of them. Or maybe they make these sprites as they need them for the specific characters, and there's no actual like Kirby variant of that of that gun holding sprite. Who knows? Oh my god. Jesus. <laughs> there were two gunshots. Hey, hold on. He might be doing some shit out there. Oh, did she twitch? I, I, I didn't. I didn't catch it. Uh, I love the. I love the spirits excel. Um, uh, exclamation point. Psh. It's so fun. <laughs> Oh boy. What the hell? Ah, oh, hammer space! Oh, uh, Penny's such a good design. You. Sir, fuck you! Sorry. I mean, they did get suspended. <laughs> I, guess, I guess she shouldn't be too surprised that, that, they're, that they're weirdos. <laughs> there's so many there's so many good drawings in this episode so far. Which is not a thing I usually get to say during sprite series. Oh boy. Alright. Alright. <laughs> don't 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 look at me like that. I, I like I like that she has glasses. Thank thank you, Jim, for having glasses. Oh, I like the song. Pocket sound. Can they, can they? Can they pour like a jug of water into the pocket star and then like and then like hover it over someone's head and let it all out? How how, how does it quantify liquids?
<laughs> yeah, and then I killed her. This is unacceptable. This is unacceptable. I wonder which character that is. I'll be honest, I, 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 until this rewatch, I never, like, thought even for a second that, that his, like, red streak might be hair, but now it's so obvious. I was just so used to looking at King Sombra and, like, seeing, like, oh yeah, red horn. Clearly he's got a red horn. With, like, a little, with, like, a little like, purple around it. Yeah, it makes perfect sense. Ah, uh, I love the Kirby cell phone, so cute. Uh oh, uh oh, oh come on! We don't we don't get to see we don't get to see like a like a like a like a like would be a staticky um a staticky portrait. Crusade, you must kill. It will be so funny if you kill. It will be such a good bit if you kill. It's interesting that they invented the pocket stars. Honestly, it, I feel like most most people. I mean, she's like she just put her put herself in a way into nothing. If you're gonna if you're gonna let them be able to do that, then I don't think you really need to have a pocket star to explain things like, such as that. Ah, come on, go fight red guy. It'll be funny. Pointless. Hi, Jem. Hello, Percival. Classic character, Percival. Everyone loves Percival. Huh? Oh boy. If you... Um, but I already did it once, so it's too hard. Oh, okay, that's not what I thought. I thought, I thought she, she was gonna cut in and say, Oh, I can't, so. <laughs> ah! Excuse me. Later. That's the Kirby walk away. <laughs> She's so mad. Oh, she's not mad. It's fun how like whenever I see this, whenever I see these forward and back walk cycles and sheets, I'm always like, oh man, it looks so choppy. But actually seeing it in motion, it looks it genuinely just looks fine. Sprites are su sprites are such weird things to animate with. Has she lost an eye before? Ugh. Weird, uh, weird that you can just teleport to things. Because I, I, I would think that like the brig ship is like constantly moving, yeah? Can you teleport to wherever the brig ship is with that with that um with those rules or is it like you teleport to where you think the brig ship is and then you just fall out of the sky? Ah, poor fella. Hi, Ace. Ooh, <laughs> that sounds like that sounds like a custom voice line to me. The 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 mic quality was a bit off. You, you you can tell you can tell who's got a you can tell who's from like a guilty gear game and who's from like 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 your friend on Discord.
You know, people people make custom Kirby's now that have whites in their eyes. I, I imagine like if they ever did like a, like an overhaul of the Spirits Excel art style, we we could expect like like sprites that actually have whites in their eyes. That'd be that'd be that'd be interesting to see. <laughs> I, I like the Kirby eyes just fine. I'm not, I'm not actually suggesting that because it would be a big undertaking and it might like give um, varying results. But it would be it would be interesting to see some of these characters with like whites on their eyes because it would match the portraits, you know, It'd be fun. There. People like uh, people like Jody have that now, and um, the the uh, the I mentioned them last time. The the red guy from Kirby Battle Blitz with fire powers. Molotov, why aren't you wearing your glasses and looking cool? Oh, is your power ice? I was wondering why there were two water guys. <laughs> uh, animal monster, remember? No! What's going on here? Hmm. Whoa, that was that was very much a Kirby Superstar Ultra Sprite. Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> oh god, don't use those. Hold on, I I I have to I have to shrink by like like six inches. Shoo. <laughs> weird. Uh, never a good idea to mix those. Why are you not finished with them? What makes them more special? I love when they do little flips and they go vroom. Too slow. Do you need to- oh it is Hydra, so maybe it is just water. You don't need to put in like a- You don't need to put in a period if there's a- if there's a- if there's a tilde, do you? I don't remember how it works. I can't believe you are here and real. <laughs> if you if you just like watch this with like only the voice clips and don't look like a text, it's like you're watching one of those like one of those like 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 um baby sensory videos. And then baby sensory, like like one of those like um uh, pff, uh like like a like content farm videos, you know? It just has like a bunch of like sound effects of like characters walking around and like and, like doing things. <laughs> Yeesh, poor fella. Oh boy. Tell me more. I love boxing. There should be more boxing characters. I'm pretty sure there's at least one boxing character later on. I love bo I love boxing. We we did see one before with the one that was like pumping their fist in the air. But unsurprisingly, the only characters from that from that scene that are going to be relevant later are the, are the Kirby's with hair. Who could have guessed? Dude, the point is, is that like he he would have died. Sheesh. Oof. Man, I really want to see that, that see that that pink guy without his without his helmet and stuff. He lives. Nobody knocked at my door, and I would never ruin my reaction video by forgetting to tell people that I was recording. I would never... I, anyways. <laughs> and he is all fucked up. Goddamn! No! 
He's gonna sacrifice himself. No. We'll never see him without his visor. That's fine. That would be like seeing that would be like seeing the uh, the engineer's face, or the, or the soldier without his helmet covering his eyes. So let me get this straight. I'm somewhere I wouldn't exactly call Earth. Anyways. <laughs> I'm seeing freaking dragons, and oh yeah, I'm talking to a cuff. <laughs> Impudence. What? Anyways, I, I like I like that he has the Mennonite cape. I like when people give their characters the Mennonite cape. That's true! You're stupid! You deserve to die for, your stu for being stupid. Eat shit. I love toxins. My dream is eat dirt. Well, I hear you thinking shit! Oh my god. <laughs> I'm looking for a bitch who can go all night, baby! <laughs> ah, he's so cool. I love when this is a character's bit. I love when a character's bit is, I'm too strong and nothing nothing feels good because I'm too strong. It's always fun. <laughs> Poor fella. Oh. Hey, don't sweat it. Hey, don't sweat it. That sounds familiar. I like I like I like when a character has a card power. I like card powers. Hmm. Card power. Hmm. I like that they started running fast, but they're only moving a little bit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Virtual insanity. Hostile intense so strong it overwhelms you. Oh, is this highlight is still purple? Is it really is it really the red guy doing this? It feels a little feels a little unlike him. I thought he was having fun. Who could it be if, if not him? Could it be a new character? Or could it just simply be red guy again? Oh, Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> Bro, his one-liners are so shit. Try harder. Oh god. Jesus. <laughs> dead guy? Oh no, dead guy. Foolish boy. Uh oh. No, our named character is gonna die. Every minute I don't get my my prey back, I'm killing a hostage. No, no, no. You're gonna eat shit. No, you're gonna eat shit.
What the? <laughs> Jesus. What? <laughs> Not again. You move him like five feet, dog. He's gonna like he he can get here in like less than a second. <laughs> Time to end this. Oh, poor fella. Oh, come on. Pay attention. Dude, come on. You are so shit. This guy is such a little dickhead. <laughs> God, don't, you shouldn't have with this guy. I know everything, actually. Fuck off, man. Shut up. You were, you have done nothing but eat shit this whole time. Oh, except for that one time, but whatever. <laughs> My name is Ace. Yeah, what's your real name? Oh boy, oh boy. And that's like the same gun spray, but it's black. Maybe it is maybe it is from Scribble Knots. With excitement. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> We're gonna fly into somebody and, and like the explosions the explosion effect happens. Oh boy, oh boy. I love the I love the the, the, the sprite animation spin sound effect. Such a such a such a good one. Oh my god. Leave her alone. Ugh. Jesus. I, I like that sound effect too. I don't usually hear it in things, but it, but it used to be in uh, it used to be in Super Mario Z a lot. I know most sprite sound effects are are, are ones that were used in that, but um, th there's some that even th that haven't even like survived much past that. Oh, she has the she has the Samus thing, of course. Useless. <laughs> Ain't no way this is doing anything. He's too crazy powerful. Come on. All that for a drop of blood, etc, etc. Don't believe it. I don't believe it! Jesus! You kind of fucking made a giant fucking hole! <laughs> uh, I got suspended because of Crusade. No you didn't! You got suspended because your special move causes more property damage than a fucking like than like a million rampaging dark heroes. Like Jesus Christ, look at this shit. <laughs> God. Yeah, I have three attacks. I can shoot my gun. I can whip things, and I can uh, level a building. Like whoa, whoa, slow down. S slow, slow it down there. Cool, cool sprite, also. Lessinger. This is a good result for <laughs> I like the voice clip. You did, you did good, Ace. C mana. C 
see mana? I told you. Jesus. Unbelievable. <laughs> Poor fella. It's fine. Kirby's can't die from physical damage. They're 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 puffy. You punch you punch a Kirby, it like it like just goes into them like memory foam. Hey, don't sweat it. If these aren't like, man. If, if these aren't like um from like just someone on over Discord, I wonder like where these voice clips are from because man, is the audio quality worse than most of these? Ah! Jesus. Oh, I see. There's a difference. Got it. Yeesh. Maybe I don't want to be a Pokemon champion. Maybe I will be a professor. <laughs> Who the fuck? <laughs> Goku! I love bitches with umbrellas. And, and not enough umbrella characters in the Kirby community, frankly. Everyone's like, I want a sword! Yeah, everyone's got a fucking sword. All having a sword means is that you're gonna be like overpowered in Kirby Battle Blitz. It doesn't make you cool. Unless your sword does some crazy shit, it's like whatever. I think the coolest sword character is definitely Null, but like, you know, kind of an unfair fight. Everyone fucking loves Destruction Series characters. But Null's the coolest sword character, and then like, and like from there everyone else is like so low. Like, oh yeah, Jody's got a sword. I never think about Jody's sword. Um, the Yoru has a sword. It's just the Buster sword, but red. Like, come on. You need to really, you need to really do some 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 crazy shit if you've got a sword. Because like otherwise, you're just a drop in an ocean. You're just a drop in the ocean. Seriously. No fucking way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. They put a hole in him. How could... <laughs> Looks so goofy. Uh oh. <laughs> Lucky day. Yeah, what a surprise. The strongest guy ever wasn't beaten by two B-tier characters. Sorry, a B-tier character and like a D-tier character. I genuinely do not remember like Ace being in any episodes other than this one. I hope I hope to see him more, but Ah. Uh... Don't be like that. I'm just, I'm just being silly. I'm just being silly and funny. I love the weird way he words it. Like, knowing that this show is very anime inspired makes me think that like certain wordings of things are inspired by like the way localizations affect like um, phrases that are hard to translate. So challenge my existence is a very strange thing to say, but you wouldn't feel too out of place. Seeing it on- seeing it, like, in some captions, you know? Jesus. Leave him alone. I know people- I, I'm very used to seeing that sprite when, that he uses when he hovers, but I don't remember what it's from now that I think about it. Oh no, her arm. Poor fella. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Nameless Sword Knight, you must eat, you must be ass, please. Oh, yeah, wait a second, we never found out what happened to Molotov and Hydro. Oh. 
o the voice inside your head it's interesting i think i i wonder if we'll ever see a redraw a redrawn portrait for this guy because this, the the mask seem to seems to be a decent amount smaller on on his sprite than it is on this portrait and i like i kind of like that better Though I guess here, though I guess here it matches the portrait. It just depends on the sprite, I guess. Oh, oh. sweet. Oh, Jesus! Maybe when I get sent to the Shadow Realm. Ow! Crusade, what the fuck? You need a break? Crusade, you can do some shit like that. Could... Oh, he's king class. <laughs> I, f I forgot about that. Interesting that somebody who gets suspended so easily would make it all the way to king class. Maybe he just maybe he skipped a few grades. Oh boy. Hi Andy. Oh hey. It's you. Out of the way. I wanna see I forgot her name. God damn it! There's already enough characters for me to forget names. Oh no. That kid. Oh, it is combo! It is combo! Oh my god! Are we gonna see him in the episode? I'm just not gonna acknowledge that one, okay? Anyways. Oh boy. Oh boy. Why would you listen? <laughs> Why does he care? Crusade. If you simply if you simply did not listen and just started beating his ass, you would win. Exer? Exer? No, your name's Red Guy. Be nameless. Jesus. <laughs> looks over. Hey, you seem to be repressing her, her voice. Like, I can tell that you're doing that. Hmm. Crusade. What the fuck? Andy, what the fuck are you doing, dog? Say, you're eating shit. You're eating shit. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, it's okay, Molotov. He's gonna leave soon. It's fine. The elixir. No, it's it's toxin. 
There's no elixir, it's it's poison. Oh boy, oh boy. I wonder what will happen. Impudence! <laughs> Come on. So are they all like a little family? Or, or what? Molly. I like Molly a lot. She's fun. Into the depths of demons. Ready to ready to breeze into the behemoths of episode three. <gasps> oh my god. Poor fella. Foolish boy. Um, have a nice fall. Um. How could he's fine? He pressed. He pressed. He pressed the R trigger right before it, it happened. So he he guarded. It's fine. Oh Jesus! Is he missing an arm? Bit much. And we give him a hand. We give him a hand. There. Maybe they're all British. <laughs> uh oh. Why? Your mission was to bring it back. You stupid fuck. Oh god. <laughs> Don't do it. Alright, stand back. Jesus! Don't step on that, you fuck! <laughs> Cute detail about this how they included the little squish. Just a drop? Just a drop of I declare this drop of hot sauce to be very, very hot. Oh oh. Uh oh. oh. <laughs> if I can launch him up there. Unbelievable. Uh oh. Jesus. He's a werewolf! He's a Digimon? <laughs> uh, my X-Trait makes me stronger when I die! Lol. Uh-oh. Damn! He is a Digimon. 
Oh my god. You gonna fight him or are you gonna leave? Uh Alright. No cool no no cool scene versus X ray? Ah, uh, poor fella. Crusade! Crusade! <laughs> Where are you going, Crusade? Monsters like you and I are practically engineered to kill each other. <laughs> He's so fun. Oh. Oh. He ate shit. Hi, Sundine. Hey, guys. Oh, God! Yeah, whatever. There's no dang Caramel City. It's like living in fucking Gotham. You don't go. You you don't go here because this place is cool. <laughs> Mo most most evil like horrible shit ridden city in the whole world. Oh god, he's covered in eyes. Combo, there's our boy. It's been two episodes. Where have you been? <laughs> a, com a, a combined 30 frames of, of combo were on screen. Yay! It's so interesting that this is made in Flash 8. There's actually people. Uh, so for people who are still using Flash 8 to make um to make sprite series, um there are some genuine advantages to using newer versions of Flash, and I'm not talking about the fucking camera tool because that thing is ass. And it's just and obje and objectively VCam is probably better. Just because you can just because you can set its position with like um numbers and you can't do that with the with the um with the flash camera. And also I, I don't think that's that the flash camera likes snapping to things as much as VCam does. Because you know, VCam's a symbol. Honestly, if you can, I would just recommend putting the entire fucking uh, animation in a in a symbol and moving that around. That's what I would do. But I have like tools that make that easier for me. So for people that are still using Flash 8, uh, if you want to like upgrade to to at least like Flash 20, like like like, like um Adobe Animate like CC 2018, um, and like okay for the record, I know Flash 8 is like free and the other ones aren't, and you so you have to like be a little like sneaky if you're gonna get them for free. So you know I get it, not always an appealing thing, but if you can manage to get your hands on newer versions, there are some genuine advantages. The envelope tool is great. I, the fucking Flash 8 probably has the envelope tool, but the envelope tool is really good for like sprite warping. Um, um, newer versions of Flash have built in, I've got like a set of built in tweens that make like doing certain motions a lot easier. And you don't have to just rely on like ease in 100, ease, ease in negative 100 and ease, and ease out 100. You don't have to rely on those all the time and you don't have to like, and you don't necessarily have to like use the the graph editor yourself, though that is like not that hard to do. There's a lot of good um in newer versions. Like I like that in particular. Um geez, what else is there? Uh they have improvements to the brush tools, but you know, that's only so useful in Flash. Um it's nice to it's nice to I don't know if they have this in Flash 8. I know you can make drawings into brushes for the line tool. So if you have like a character who has like um who has like Say, what if you have a character who has like, um, like a, like a, like, a, like um, like one of those, uh, boxing gloves on like a thing, you know, like, like, like the cartoon, like boxing glove on, um, on like, uh, on like a gun that it goes, it goes sproying and it comes out and you make a sprite for the sproying thing, but you don't want to like animate it, like stretching out. You could just add that to like a fucking, you can make, you can make that a brush and then you, and then you could, and then you could, uh, just bend it any which way you want and, and it'll automatically look pretty good. I don't know. There's a lot of th there's a lot of things in newer versions of Flash that are nice. Um, I guess when it comes to specifically sprite animation, there's not that many advantages though. But I really I really think that people should be using newer versions than Flash Eight. I, I and, and for all I know that Sky already is because this is like this is episode three. Um, this is the HD version, so it's not exactly the um, it's not exactly going to show me the 
uh, original upload date. But you know, for all I know, it'll uh, for for all I know, they're still using Flash Eight. There are some genuine advantages to using newer versions. I also think I'm also very surprised by the fact that people are still using such low quality sound effects. I guess that's just because that's how it's done, and nobody really bats an eye when they hear it in a spray animation because spray animations are just kind of. Spray animations just kind of perpetually feel like they're from 2009 because everyone's still using an old version of Flash and everyone's still using like sound effects that like were run through like a, a toaster first. You know, the, the same ones from like original Super Mario Bros. Also, everyone seems to use like soundtracks that are from the mid 2000s, which is great. I love that, but it's so it makes everything feel like it's from so long ago. Um, but yeah, that's how that's how it is. Um, I I love newer versions of Flash just because of the advantage, just because of like the, the the mild conveniences they have. Um, I didn't like when they changed the background color and I couldn't change it back, but whatever. Um, I am using 2019 now against my will because it does have just just enough things that I want to use it. In any case, let's let's fin let's finish up these credits. Oh, Ace is a fan character. That's interesting. I wonder if we're going to see more characters made by other people. Is that going to be in the credits of every episode, or is that just going to be in episodes that Ace is in? Hmm, Chrono Cross. Mm-hmm, I really like this song that plays at the end. It's a really good song. Thank you, Cosmic Wonder. I'm surprised. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised that Fine Sounds is here, not Free Sound. Free Sound is great. Also, crediting YouTube is like crediting Google Images, <laughs> but whatever. No thanks to, to to the boys. There we go. J J Jim Jim Krebs thirty for for the for the beautiful um for for the beautiful spaceship. Kaiju King. I I feel like that's got to be um. I know I said that last time, but I'm pretty sure that's King of Silas. Um, and I think uh, I think Squeaky Leaf is Leafy K. I, I don't know how many people call themselves Leaf. Oh, wait, no, Jebo, wait, no, what am I talking about? Jim Krebs did... Maybe maybe Jim Krebs and Jebo both do background sprays, because they both sound familiar. Special thanks to DeviantArt. They will they will see this. Uh, I guess there's no I guess there's no uh, end credit scene. That's a shame. Well, before it switches over, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. I'm really looking forward to watching episode four. I've always, whenever I see, it's funny, whenever I see the episode four thumbnail, I get a little squicked out because like, um, Sundine looks incredibly, incredibly human-like in that, in that, in that, in that thumbnail. Um, but anyways, <laughs> I'll see you guys later. I love episode three. It's a lot of fun. There's so much fun. To, there's so much fun to it. And I'm really looking forward to seeing some of the, some of the characters that are introduced in, in future episodes. And maybe, maybe like getting, getting the ball rolling on like actually like, you know, cause like, I feel like a lot of, a lot of early Spirits Excel is just introducing new things one after the other, getting you hooked on their story and then switching gears. So it's like, I really hope we can get to a point where we start just like switching between previous things we've seen and not introducing more stuff. Cause I know that they keep introducing stuff for a good while. There's a lot of, this is a very, very ambitious series and I, and I can only, and I, and I can only respect it for that because it's still gone on longer than any other. Like most episodes are in the neighborhood of like 20 to 40 minutes and it's got like 20 episodes, like counting the different parts of different episodes. So it's like, Jesus Christ, they're doing a really good, they're doing really well for themselves. Um, hopefully we will get to see how this all plays out someday. But, and, but yeah, next video, uh, Spirit Excel episode four. Um, once again, thanks for watching. If you have any sp series you think I should watch that's very like narrative focused that I can like pick apart, then please recommend it in the comments below, and I'll see you then.